Karl Marx succeeds in causing a proletariat revolution against capitalists, but can he win here? Probably. Ah, the old communist gambit open. Hey chess bros, how am I supposed to win this situation? I only have one piece left, but clearly, uh, so does my opponent. I feel like the only thing that has even a chance to beat in a biblically correct angle is your bishop. How is this a draw? I literally have one king and 32 bishops. This game is so unbalanced. What will this piece finally get buffed? Virgin English chess piece names. We have the pawn, the rook, the king, the queen, the bishop, the knight versus the chad check chess piece names. Foot soldier, tower, king, lady, archer, horse. I don't care if I'm an English speaker. This is always just going to be a horse. And this makes way more sense to be just a foot soldier. Maybe that's why they named checkmate after the checks. My opponent just came out as trans. How do I support them? You can support them by getting absolutely obliterated. Slay second queen. What the frick is wrong with all you guys? Grab your pitchforks and help overthrow the commonwealth. Or in other words, this is just France during the French Revolution. They just need more guillotines. Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you Chess 2. What? Finally, the game we've been waiting thousands of years to make a sequel for. And just look at all these new updated mechanics. There is unicorns? Me showing chess people that Bishop in Italian is Alfari. Sorry, I butchered that. Which is the one who brings the flag because who the frick would bring a bishop to battle? I swear, so many other countries named their chess pieces way better than in English. This actually should be how we divide the world for the next Cold War. The blue countries say knight, the yellow countries say horse. Meanwhile, all the green countries refer to them as jumper? Really? Chess may not be famous in Korea, but it's the most famous game in the world. Yesterday, at a fifth youth tournament, a boy caused controversy, he sacrificed his black piece to the queen and shouted, Nagasaki Gambit. <laughs> He then flipped the chessboard over, causing it to fall, and wrote Black Victory. Wait, so is this why the Japanese don't play chess? For that, and I guess the Hiroshima gambit. What happens if someone dies during a chess match? According to the FIDE rule, the game is declared a dead draw. I mean, I guess it does sound better than a dead surrender or dead victory. But just imagine you're one move away from beating this guy, then he dies and you have to call it a draw. Hey guys, what's this move called? We have two bishops. We have uh, one bishop revolving around another, then it getting slingshotted all the way through diagonally. Um, that, to say I haven't tried that one before, but I, I need to. Ah, the Vat Cannon Gambit, that's right. Yo guys, I literally murdered my opponent yesterday. He literally stood no chance. Absolutely slaughtered him. Yesterday, my opponent multiplied the board with a vector. What do I do now? I'm playing as white, by the way. If you're not prepared to create your own vector, yourself, then you're just too much of a novice, I guess. Can you please resign? I want to poop so bad. Bruh. Please. Draw. Sure, bro. Thank you. I knew using this strategy can help you get out of a police ticket, but to also help you avoid the L in chess? You're wasting my time. I literally rule the world. Let's play chess. I'm better than all chess software and the best human players combined. No one ever beats me. I go first. E4. QX, E1. Checkmate. Game over. I win. My pieces can move wherever the freak I want. I just acquired chess from Jerry Chess, so I make the rules. But chess doesn't work that way, though. This is why you have zero bit. You're an insignificant little ant compared to me, with no hope of ever getting anywhere near my level. Get this through your skull. The rules of everything bend towards me. Noted. Never play Elon. Question. How did I lose? I literally got four in a row. Oh my goodness. Connect four. This is like the Exodia of chess universe. I have no idea why I'm bringing up Yu-Gi-Oh right now. Chess.com congratulating me on getting a victory. Me, one move from being checkmated, but my opponent from Kyrgyzstan lost connection. Bruh, dub's a dub. She said yes, I think I'm gonna cry. What a special day, mate in one. Literally. Hey guys, for this strat, I'm using underage pawns to attract the opposing bi- <sighs> Wait. New chess DLC spin-off game just dropped. Replace your monarchy with a theocracy. You no longer have a king and a queen, just four bishops. The other player has to kill all of them. That actually does sound fun. If I win, would that be referred to as a religious victory? I for one prefer to play as horde governments or the Mongol Empire though. The name for the rook used all around the world? This is where English actually takes a pretty big L. What even is a rook? The vast majority of languages all throughout the world just call it a tower. I mean, what else is it? That is a tower. Oh, but I do like the green countries. They call it a cannon. And apparently this is the new move in order to beat the two rooks, or I guess I'm just going to start saying towers. So there's two towers and this... Oh, 
Okay. Yeah, new chess piece just dropped. This is known as the trolley. A trolley is headed towards eight of your pawns. You can pull the lever to change the track and divert the trolley towards the opposing side's pawns. But is it truly ethical to selectively save only those whose ideology align with yours the most? Is it truly okay for you to decide who should live or die in the situation? Furthermore, would it really be fair to put the opponent at such a disadvantage just because you went first? Where did the extra white pawn come from? Well, you see, when a mommy pawn and a mommy pawn love each other very much, they perform- Okay, no. Yeah, I just got my pawn to the other side of the board. Time to change it out for a much more powerful piece. Wait, what? Chess microtransactions! You did great in the fight, so I'll promote you, says the king. Really? I'm gonna be a general now, says this pawn? No, my wife. W what? Wait, this is actually a super common thing. I marry my best soldier too, though. Chess, but both the kings are gay. Almost all the pieces are supportive. Almost all the pe- Oh, I- Oh, I- I can- I can see which- which ones are, uh, missing. We just told all the pawns there was a game today. <laughs> April Fools. Once again, the higher-ups just doing a little bit of trolling to the peasants. I'm going to assume there's no way you can actually win this, can you? Yo, bros, what exactly is my opponent doing here? One of these random bubbles just popped up above one of my pieces. Wait, is that the Plague Inc. icon? Oh my god, he just started an epidemic. Hello, we are about to launch and- an all-out attack on your house. Sincerely, zombies. Wait, now that I think about it, Plants for Zombies is just kind of like chess spinoff. Literally with the exact same board and everything. Chess in the year 2500, when it finally becomes a first-person shooter. Don't mind the fact that in 400 years, the graphics will still look like an early 90s game. This thing is about to be a banger. The black player just placed a star to bend space-time. What should I do in this position? Your best bet might just be to wait till it goes supernova and explodes the entire universe. Help! My opponent suddenly started to glue all his pieces together. What do I do? Oh my god, the ultra rare Transformers Gambit. Nobody can beat Megatron here. Don't tell the other side, but I've been secretly building a small tunnel to reach through his defenses. He has no idea he's about to be checkmated. Dudes, look at the impenetrable fortress I just created. My king is super safe back here. Literally nothing can stop what- Wait a second. Okay, maybe this is why we shouldn't call this piece a knight he he really is a He's a jumper. He's he's gonna jump over all this. Fun fact, many players don't know this, but there is a cut through the bishop piece, and the historical reason for this is to put a Dorito there as a mid-game snack. Even chess players need their gamer fuel. Wait, I'm now just realizing a lot of the world calls the bishop piece an elephant. Man, this totally changes everything. The jokes are all ruined! Wait, but where did they get elephant from this? Okay, let's see if you can walk in a perfectly straight line. Uh-oh, thinks this pun. If only this guy wasn't there. Plane is white. I'm about to enter my first end game. Any advice before I go? I hate to say it, my dude, but I'm pretty sure this king alone will not beat the Ender Dragon. Who you got? There's L Taker, Jumper, Horsey, Borky, Dog, That, Zigzagger, Pony, Placer Bets, and let the race begin. Oh, just a good old time at the racetrack. My opponent just built a literal fortress. Should I promote this pawn right here into a battering ram? I would advise no. Probably turning him into a siege tower would be more effective. Guys, what? What do I do? I've never played this version of chess before. When you lose your king, does the OS just crash? I call this the Saddam Gambit, placing my king behind an entrance of bricks and rubble. And here he is laying. He's got himself even a fan and stuff. They play chess very differently in Iraq. The late king, my father, just appeared as a ghost and told me my uncle poisoned him to steal the throne. What am I supposed to do now? This is one of those moments where you kind of have to murder your uncle now, which is a common chess strat. This is the fastest move in chess, as the king and rook have to go at light speed to no clip through each other. Man, you just gotta love that speed running community. They're always finding little things like this. Help, guys. My opponent is a single mother of two. Is it ethical to attack her? Looks might be deceiving here, though. This is a pretty powerful little family. Plus, is she getting child support? Divide a chessboard in two, and the queens all become kings. This is apparently another spin-off version to play chess. Um, I, why do I just want to Thanos snap one side completely, though? Maybe if one side loses the 
the other side gets Thanos snap. Yo, guys, I need help. My opponent literally controls the means of production. Bruh, like, I'm pretty sure it's over before it even began. Literally just like three foot soldiers. Hey, guys, what opening strategy is this? I actually have seen this one before. This is the old Trojan horse strat. You offer this rook as a gift, and then once you get behind enemy lines, they all burn the city down. By city, I mean Troy. Guys, I, I can explain. You have two special moves, and I only have one? I can use only my special move once. Oh, that was that no clipping thing that they were talking about. You guys are getting special moves, says the queen. Totally forgot about the secret strats behind all these little things. Left my chess game on for a few million years, and this is what I came back to. Unfortunately, your chess game, I think, has just become checkers. Cue the crab rave music. I was winning this game, but then my opponent gerrymandered the board. Do I even have a chance here? No, yeah, it's literally over. Just give up. A proposed rule change for chess by turning the bishop to a 90 degree angle, he can then move up, down, left, or right. I feel like these guys deserve a little buff. Could nerf the queen, though. Still, if there's any move that needs to be nerfed in the oldest strategy game of all time, it's whatever this is. The equivalent of the ender dragon, I guess, in chess. I hate when my opponent peels his skin off and turns into this. And big thanks to the patrons. Drew, I'm your dad, back with the milk. Look outside. John Denver. Luxembourg lover. I can't sleep without Drew's voice. Aaron F. Amateur archaeology. Carmel Norwal. Frederick Tiblin. Good ol' Ryan. Inquisitor Jack Trayton's annoying friend. Let me know is ten. Best Robert Ryan. E. The Pie. The Great Sebi, if you Ralphie. hear this, I love you. And why am I doing this?